Kyle Larson here at the PRI show. Uh, you know, I'm your number one PR guy. Let's get you the Indy 500. Dario Franchini's right behind me. We're pushing all the time. So now you've won a race. You're in the chase. You had a good year. When do you get, put your arm around the old chipster and say, let's go to Indy, baby? I need to do it soon. I'm going to see him uh, this coming week, so maybe I'll bring it up. I'll say it, stop by. I saw Robin. We really need to get to do the double this year. <laughs> because I think this the timing's perfect because... You know, I, the, you got to strike while the iron's hot. I mean, he needs to win the race, too, because, you know, they got their butt kicked last week. <laughs> yeah, they, uh, yeah, yeah, that was a tough, tough Indy 500. It was us. for them, but the the thing that is, for you, just your whole outlook on the whole thing with NASCAR, that's like getting this big burden, off, you, you know, you were close all these times, now you got this thing out, so now you can concentrate on having fun. That's right, to go to, yeah, I know, I, I'll definitely want to run the Indy 500 for sure, so, um, I'm going to bug Chip about it. Uh, I wanted to run last year. I wanted to do the 100th running, but, uh, yeah, I mean, I guess, you know, 101 is just good, too. The great thing, though, is you're still getting to run midgets and sprints. We'll, we'll see at the Chili Bowl. Uh, maybe go down under this year? Yeah, I'm going to go to Australia. I leave uh, in a couple weeks. Uh, we get there on Christmas. I'm going to run four nights, uh, race every other night there, uh, come back the third, and then uh, to the Chili Bowl, uh, and then that's it for my dirt race and for the off season. But I still get to run a lot throughout the year, so um, been uh, planning planning my schedule out. I just saw smoke over here, so I'm going to have to once I get my schedule done, I'm going to have to email it to him so we can line up and race with each other. Is it hard for Chip, because Chip didn't grow up in a dirt, is it hard, is, I think your argument's easy. Look how sharp I can stay by, by, by driving these cars. And I, do, do you think that he understands that? Um, I think he understands it, but it's a big risk at the same time. So I, I get it on his end. Um, but for sure, you know, I, I'm used to racing, or not, I'm not used to it anymore because I don't do it as much. But uh, there in 2011 and 12, I you know, ran over 100 races, uh, 120 something. Um, so I, you know, I feel like, you know, the more I race, like you said, you know, the, the sharper I stay. Um, I think it shows. You know, this year I got to. They let me run a lot more. Um, you know, last year I think I ran maybe one, one right. or two dirt races throughout the season. Or this year I ran, you know, twenty something, and uh, had my best season ever in Cup. So. Um, I hope he realizes that and maybe it's tough. You know, I, I run 25 races, you know, January to January and that's about all I can get. So I, I would say I want to run more, but it's hard to really find, you know, midweek races to run. Sure. But it's cool. You're getting to do it. All right. Are you people watching there? If Ganassi doesn't get this kid to Indy, I'm taking up a collection starting April 1st. Send me a hundred dollar bill. Kyle Larson goes to Indy. Kara Robin Miller. Go fund me account. Go, go fund, fund, go fund Kyle Larson. Thanks kid. <laughs>